I'm not you used to criticize these things before you came to power. One minute. Exactly. You used to criticize these things. You used to say we'll be different. 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 You used and in an even more blatant manner. Arna, Mr. Goswami, Arna, this security has not been provided the same at the behest of the Indian even more blatant Indian manner. government. Aren't this you? was provided because the intelligence agencies tell us Arna, that the man's life is at risk. And the uh, white uh, category cover was not enough Arna, for the government. Can I just make Kumar a few Mangla. points? Gaurav Bhatia, rebutting you five minutes on this Arna, debate. Let's see. I want to see if the BJP Everybody can explain their position tonight. Yeah, go ahead. I hope I will not be... Gaurav Bhatia. Gaurav Bhatia is responding to the BJP. First Go ahead. of all, I am I am uh, I am worried about the complainants who filed a case against Mr. Sangeet Som. What kind of justice will they get when an accused person like Mr. Sangeet Som would enter the court premises with his Z plus security cover? Would he not threaten the witnesses in the case? Second, if there were such serious intelligence inputs regarding his threat to life, why were these inputs not shared with the state government so that we could have acted? I think they have been tutored by the BJP to give him this extra security cover. And last but not the least, the BJP was talking about development before the elections. Yesterday it was love jihad is equal to development. Today it is giving security to criminals is equal to development. What's the message you're sending, Ms. Kumara Mangalam? The message is this. No, no, no. The message is this. Unfortunately, I can't change Mr. Bhatia's uh, mindset. But the fact is that nobody ever said love jihad is equal to development. In fact, what we have still said today is that we are here to provide equal access and equal opportunity to everybody in the country. Love jihad is, is a term that has been coined to cover certain no, things that are happening. And as that is not the topic of today's discussion, I'm not going to go into detail about that. Please let's not move away from the central topic of today's discussion. Before we were coming for this discussion, Mr. Yogi Adityanath has again said that we also declare love jihad and we will punish all the Muslim youths who are targeting Hindu girls. Mr. Yogi Adityanath, just an hour back, I've been told, has made this statement. Why don't you act against him? Mr. Bhatia, try and listen to me. Mr. Yogi Adityanath is a member of parliament from your party. He is the same member of parliament who becomes a leader who speaks on communal violence on the floor of the house. He is so important in the BJP. And today you say that he is not the spokesperson. Is he not the member of parliament of BJP? He is not. It's a fact. Yogi Adityanath is an MP. Yes, he has his own individual opinion. Is he opinions, not the member of parliament of BJP? That is not the opinion of the party. I am the official spokesperson. So, Miss, so, so, Miss, so, Miss Kumara Mangalam, let me ask you. So, Miss Kumara Mangalam, let me ask you. You are a spokesman for the party. Miss, Miss Kumara Mangalam, one second. One second. MPs are allowed to spread communal hatred. Miss, Miss Kumara Mangalam. Miss Kumara Mangalam. That your MP. Please can spread communal hatred. Okay, okay, one minute. So, Ms. Kumara Mangalam, here's the message. Here's the message that you're sending. Here's the message that you're sending. And, and please be patient tonight. You're being very aggressive, which is interesting. Here's the message I think you're sending. Your message is commit a crime. I, I too can be aggressive sometimes or not. It's all right. It's all right. You've been newly appointed yeah. official BJP spokesman. Maybe this is what your party has told you to do. That's all right. No problem. But, but, but regardless, of, regardless of the form in which you are presenting your views, I am more interested in the content of your views. The question is this, the message in my view that you are sending is this. Okay. Go ahead, divide the people, make all kinds of hateful remarks, circulate fake videos to incite violence, promote, promote communal enmity, disturb public order, Deliver hate speeches at Mahapanchayats. And don't worry about what will happen when all this happens. Don't worry because we are after you. We are there for you because don't worry when your threat perception increases. We at the Ministry of Home Affairs can ensure that the taxpayer pays 
for the best possible world class security to be made available for your every need don't care about the people in the relief camps don't care about the children who died in the cold after the muzaffarnagar riots which you incited can i reply but we will ensure that the best possible okay, security Mr. one Mr. second Mr. one second now let me complete i will complete my point best possible security bulletproof cars escort vehicles two three rings paramilitary personnel from the itbp and the crpf who instead of protecting national installations protect you the only question we are asking ma'am is this how does sangeet som become a national asset how does a hate monger become a national asset on whom the country must waste money to protect and do not miss do not do not miss kumar mangalam go uh, uh, you know try to turn this question i am asked how does the question is simple and pointed how does sangeet som become a national asset ask me is a national embarrassment is a national shame you make him a national asset mr goswami yes mr can i now reply yes ma'am okay mr goswami first of all nobody from the bjp has called mr soman asset oh really i presume he you is know, three tiers of security uh, cleared this morning in terms one way or the other asset speak for word security is not given just to assets i don't know why you're trying to twist the whole matter no, i'm, I'm repeating what is, okay so second what, what, is what is sangeet som famous for what is sangeet som famous for the fact is that what is sangeet som famous for because the intelligence what is sangeet som famous for or they notorious for it. what is sangeet som I notorious for intelligence data not shared with the state government lalita whatever sangeet som yes, may or may no, not be notorious no for is extraneous to this question without whatever he may or may not be known for famous for this this famous for whatever is not central to this question the question here is that the intelligence agencies in whatever their capacity is have been asked to assess or during the course of their assessment of various leaders have said that his life is at risk and the white class security provided to him Arnab. needs to be upgraded so it was counters coming in 4 minutes on the Arnab. debate gorab bhatia let me answer yeah. that arnab let me answer that i i would like to apprise lalita ji of the process there is a yellow book in which various intelligence inputs come to a uh, central government or state government my question remains unanswered if there were such serious intelligence inputs coming regarding threat to his life why did the central government not share these intelligence input Sarah. with the state yes. government which was providing why category security to him why did they wait for this tutored intelligence input on the basis of which the security cover has been increased that is my question and please lalita ji let's understand that why category security itself is not an ordinary cover it's a very comprehensive security cover given to a person now there should be very cogent reasons to increase it to the highest level available these reasons have not been shared with the state government which is responsible for the securities of individual in a regular manner i i think that is why everybody is doubting the intentions and these intelligence inputs which according to me have been just obtained to give him higher security cover well i you know i i find i find the position you take very interesting given the fact that if there's somebody who has led the people of uttar pradesh down it is the samajwadi party and the samajwadi party is no one to talk about muzaffarnagar or providing security because though you would like to spend all evening talking about what the bjp government it's has done about sangeet so since we it's are talking a, about muzaffarnagar no one second since He's we are talking accused today one minute since we are talking about muzaffarnagar let me remind also you also muradabad let me remind you 800 800 accused in the muzaffarnagar riots are still absconding you have done nothing as of june this year Arnab, your take away no mr mr that is not correct ah uh, mr 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 bhatia mr bhatia mr bhatia the one thing i cannot tolerate are crocodile tears the figure is not correct the one thing i can't tolerate are crocodile tears 
as of june this year 250 250 i have the right to correct you 250 families are still living in relief camps in the shamli district and your authorities your authorities go in there and tell these 250 families to vacate within three days today i think the topic was security cover to an accused person i want to talk about security cover i want to talk about security cover for azam khan's buffaloes yes Please in do. riot hit Saharanpur, there is you no, made a mockery. There is none. You provide security there to buffaloes of a minister. The, you made a joke of it. You have no right. Were given, the there security is, cover was, was given to the victims. Did you give security cover? Case. Did you give security you cover? Did you give security cover to UP uh, Minister Azam Khan's buffaloes? Answer me. Please just answer me. Did you give security cover to buffaloes? Did. See, there Did was the no buffalo security, get security cover? cover? There was no security cover, and I don't wish to answer such. Why a don't question. you want to? I can only tell you that the state government provided security cover to the victims the of the Muzaffar Nagar. Mr. Now, 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 I think, I, 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 I think, required, ladies and gentlemen, you know, one, them with security no, no, cover. one thing, one thing, Gaurav, I cannot tolerate is hypocrisy. No, no, one thing I cannot tolerate is hypocrisy. No, I, I cannot I tolerate hypocrisy at this level. Mr. Mr. I am Bhatia. not evading any question. I will answer Mr. Mr. Bhatia, now I will tell you because you do this. You see, I can't tolerate hypocrisy. So, I am asking everyone. I am asking the BJP. How on earth can you reward a hate monger like Sangeet Som? I am asking you, <coughs> how can you give security? Government, you are worried about taxpayer money going here, there for Sangeet Som. You give taxpayer money to provide security to a minister's buffaloes. And when these buffaloes got security cover, policemen were told to feed the buffaloes, get freshly prepared rotis in front of the Gagel Hadi police station. And the policemen had I'm to one minute. You can deny you anything. Can, I let me tell you. They had to pre, they had to feed they had to feed the policemen had to feed the buffaloes fresh proof? rotis. Okay, one minute proof, and then. and some were if you sent. Think you have some proof, were you sent with me. Some were Your sent to bring some were sent to bring fodder rich in, rich in jaggery or good. Then the policemen were told, prepare a bonfire so that not only do we prepare, give security to the buffaloes, we make sure there I are no mosquitoes there. I become a good script writer. I am, this is a news report of August 22nd, 2014. I'm sorry, it's embarrassing you. I compliment you. Mr. Well, I, I compliment you for providing security to buffaloes. I compliment you on being a good script that writer. After successive defeats. Well, I think this is a fact. Five. Of the BJP in different Mr. Bhatia, sarcasm is not going to hide the truth. I've denied that. They want to strengthen. I don't want to shout. Jenara and Vyas, at the last, at the end of this debate, presumably having lost the argument tonight, though we are asking all of you to tell us which side you think won this debate. Jenara and Vyas, tonight you are silent because presumably you've lost your interest in the debate. You know you are. Not the list. As as usual. You know you As have usual, no confidence Arnab, you in your own party's pres position. Presumptive, and I, 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 no, I, I was, I was just uh, looking at you firing people turn by turn, and therefore I, I thought I will not indulge into any interference. You know, we, we must look at the issue in objectivity. Number one, if whether Som was given security rightly or wrongly, Mr. Gaurav Bhatia must answer that if, if the High Court judgment was only for a purpose or till such time that he was found to be not involved, why it was not withdrawn by the state government? It would have been immediately withdrawn by the state government. That means, Mr. Adnab Goswami, threat so perception you, you existed. Now the question is, what was, Vyas, what was, what Mr. was, Vyas, what was, what was his dimension? That, that dimension only the High Court that order relying upon the High Court re order has I to be no. recalled or set aside by a superior court, or it has no. to be time bound. Which in this case it you, wasn't. There are ways. That is why. Gaura, Mr. Gaurav Bhatia, there are ways. How many times have you approached the High Court given, that now you need yes. to revise your order? You could have approached the Supreme Court. What have you done? Why no, did you I, not revise that decision I, if you were not convinced that that decision is inappropriate? In a country, you therefore, you therefore, in, a country in a country, therefore, in a country, this is one thing. Why, why don't you talk about, about, about your actions first? In a country, you are asking me, I am telling you In a country where buffaloes are provided security and in a country where buffaloes, in a country where five buffaloes of a minister get security and a hate monger gets Z category. Where do you think the Aam Admi will go? Have things truly changed? Tell us what you think. I'm going to come back with debate number three on the news tonight.